So here we have the base tech tree for Southwest USA Jurassic Difficulty Challenge Mode. And for example, if we go to medium and large herbivores, uh, we can see that there are no sauropods here. In order to make edits to the challenge modes, you need to be familiar with Cobra Tools. To find Cobra Tools, you can go to this GitHub right here. Uh, I'm not going to cover how to install this and get it working. Uh, you can find other tutorials for that. I will include a link to this GitHub in the description of this video. Now this is what the interface of Cobra Tools will look like when you launch it. Uh, you'll have to go ahead and open up a main.ovl file, which is what contains all of the game files. If we want to edit a challenge mode, we have to navigate to content zero and main.ovl. This is basically the base game files and like free content. Now this takes a little while to load. Now you will see a list of the different files within main.ovl pop up here, but Cobra Tools is not ready to be used yet. So let Cobra Tools sit for a little while so that it can load the files. When you see mapping files down here at the bottom start up, that is going to be kind of your final timer. So after mapping files gets to 100%, then you can start playing with the files in here. Now in JWE2, changes to research and other aspects of the game are controlled through patches. We can use the filter option right here to find the patches for the challenge mode. It's a little laggy. Okay, so if we want to enable all of the species in a particular challenge mode, we need to find the tech tree patch for that particular challenge mode and make edits to that. So if I'm going to edit Southwest USA, then I want to look for tech trees patches challenge five harder patch Lua. So harder is the Jurassic difficulty challenge modes. Now we just click and drag that to a file to extract it and then open it up in notepad. If we scroll down, we eventually find uh, the dinosaur research. Mixed in throughout here, you will find different removed nodes like this, remove nodes equal N1A, N4B. If we just clear these out, it, the patch will no longer remove those nodes from the tech tree. Once you've gone through and deleted every remove nodes setting from the file, you can just simply save it. And then you can go back to your folder, drag the tech tree patch back into the main.ovl file in the UI uh, of Cobra Tools, and then simply click save which will update the OVL file uh, for your game. And you should see writing main OVL in the little thing here. Once you see this line here in the command line, saved OVL in some amount of time, you know that the OVL is saved and then you can go ahead and open up the game. If you made any mistakes editing the file, the game will crash on launch. Uh, let's start a new Jurassic run here on Southwest USA. Okay, so let's look at the research tree. We've got full species roster. Every single level of the default tech tree for the dinosaurs is now present in this challenge mode. We can use any species we want to use. 